September 20th at 3.50, so make sure to get your votes in. The results of the vote will be announced at the homecoming rally on Friday, September 22nd. If you are nominated, you are asked to attend the rally on 2023 homecoming royalty. If you do win the vote, you will be walking down the red carpet with an honored educator of your choice. Be sure to email Ms. Henderson with any questions you may have. Well, let's pass it on to Eli and Aubrey for In the News. Good morning, my name is Aubrey Scholl. And I'm Eli Fisher Fernandez. We're here with your In the News update. Mexico seems set to elect its first female president next year, but which one? Over the last two weeks, both of the country's major political parties have nominated women as their candidates for the 2024 election, a historic first. Claudia Scheinbaum, the mayor of Mexico City, will face off against Senator Xochitl Galvez on the 2nd of June next year. Scheinbaum, who represents the left-wing party Morena, currently leads in the polls over the panista Senator Galvez. With several months of campaigning still to go, it's far too early to predict which of these women will become Mexico's next president. But whichever candidate met voters choose, Mexico will have made a historic decision. Meet the new iPhone 15. Apple announced the newest edition of the iPhone on Tuesday with the new colors, a titanium shell and a new charger. Despite the new features, not everyone is impressed with the design, with some describing it as an anticlimactic and lacking fundamental changes from previous designs. One critic even went, to sit, went so far as to say that Apple's innovation died with Steve Jobs. The new models will go on sale next Friday with prices ranging from $800 for the basic 15 to $1,200 for the 15 Pro Max. Olivia Rodrigo announced dates for her 2024 Guts tour yesterday, lasting from February 23rd to August 14th. The award-winning singer will have 57 concerts across Europe and North America, with the nearest one being in San Francisco on the 2nd of August. Tickets go on sale on September 21st, one week from today, and demand is expected to be high, with her last tour selling out within minutes of release. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Aubrey Scholl. And I'm Eli Fisher-Fernandez. Back, Back to, to the, the anchors. anchors. Thanks, guys. Men's basketball is looking for the ma managers this coming season. If you're interested, please stop by Coach, R Coach Rod's classroom in HJ2 for more information. Also, if you're a freshman or sophomore who is not playing a fall sport but would like to join our, in, our, in our basketball workouts and play in our fall league, Mr. Roth will have more information. If you are graduating this year and you need to make up credits, credit recovery applications are open. Courses are 12 weeks long for two days a week. Check your Synergy for more classes that are being offered. Use the links in your Synergy email to sign up with your counselor's name. The fall application to apply for California Scholarship Federation, CSF, is now available on the CSF website and in Ms. Heron's room, HJ5. The application drive will run until the end of September. All current CSF members must reapply every semester. If you are a junior or senior and you would like to apply for CSF, please stop by Ms. Heron's room and pick up an application. CSF will be hosting peer tutoring every Wednesday during pause in the cafeteria for all subjects. If you would like to attend, ask your Advo teacher to scan the QR tutoring QR code on Five Star. Well, have a, rest of your, have a great rest of your day, Wolfpack. I'm Charlie Conte. And I'm Cody Sandlin. Remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Are You OK Day, Wolfpack. Day, Wolfpack.